showtime. Okay, let's run it. What's up, world? It's your boss, International So. Tech Talk Tuesdays. <laughs> Haven't done that in a long time. Like, you subscribe, film it. and share the video. Mm. Yeah, I'm just in that kind of vibe right now. You, you smelling me? Um, pop some. Man, I got. I had glasses. Now you know. I've been. I'm. When I was young, I was cocky. Mom said you arrogant. Um, I had these in the in the. I was trying to get these a prescription for, in these. I don't usually wear prescriptions lately because I just don't really need it like that unless I'm driving and when I'm in other countries I'm never driving so I don't really need but these were hard nobody was able to put a prescription in these gazelles for me and I just had them on standby for so long but I think woo, you know uh, Nairobi Kenya Nairobi is coming up in a few months I think I'm gonna save these for Nairobi with the gazelles on them I'm gonna hurt them huh. Who? What y'all know about that? Yeah, so I'm gonna pop the gazette, the gazelles on them, uh, the gazelles on them. When I hit Nairobi, I think I'm gonna pop pop the Tom Fords on them too. When I hit Nairobi, so I'm gonna go with the what y'all think? I'm gonna go with the gazelles and the Tom Fords when I go back to the motherland. Tom Ford, bloop 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 bloop. Tom Ford. Yeah, I think. I think I'm gonna go that. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna hit them with the Tom Fords and the Gazellis. Let me know if y'all like the Gazellis and the Tom Fords for Africa. Cause I'm, you know, when I go to Africa, I gotta wear like earth tones. You know what I'm saying? Colors, browns and greens, and you know what I'm saying? On some real shea butter. You feel me? <laughs> um, we gonna get to the tech in a minute. But I'm gonna pull these Chrome Hearts back out for my next trip. I ain't had these. Yeah, some of y'all probably seen these, but I ain't had these out in a minute. I had to go through my my cases and and, and look at my glasses and, and and see what I ain't wearing in a while. These Chrome Hearts is hard too. Look at that. Ooh, ooh, boy, boy, and 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 your boy handsome. And your, and your boy your barber. You seen that? Fade, you see that line? And I could make an old nigga look like a young nigga, cause I, you know I know how to. Barbers know how to do magic, y'all. The reason why I look, part of the reason why I look younger than my age is that I always got a haircut. I always got to thank God I got my front line. My, my, it's definitely getting light. I'm, I'm trying all type of juices and berries to save my hair. But it's hard, and every and, and I bought everything on the spectrum. Every commercial you seen, every ad you seen on on Instagram about hair growth serums, I tried it all, and ain't nothing really working. But this last one, I got hope. So that's why I look young. I'm able to put a little color in my beard, shape myself up, keep myself looking good. I should just keep these on for the whole interview because my. My eyes are still a little baggy from the um, jet lag, you know, and all that traveling. I ain't still ain't sleeping right. Maybe I might have to take them off to do this unboxing, but okay. So, yeah, you know, um, and the reason why Nairobi is on the uh, list because I'm going to have to say goodbye. I'm probably going to have to say goodbye to um, Columbia, man. It's, it's too wild. Even my attorney is like, what are you going to do? You know, I put money down with an attorney to open up a business account, to put my real estate in a business account in Columbia. And my attorney's like, so what are you going to do? Are you still pursuing a property? And I'm like, hmm, that shit will piss off. So, I don't know. I think I might, you know, this might be my last hoorah in Columbia for a while. I don't know, maybe I leave, leave a little gift. A little drop a little something in pinky before I leave. <laughs> I told my son, I said, my son and my daughter, they was asking me, you going to have more kids? I was like, I don't know, maybe. 
I said, but I ain't going to be, yeah, I said, I'm going to be a bastard father if I have another kid. I told him I already did the marriage, the mom and dad, the house with the picket fence and the private schools. I did that already. I did that. I ain't got nothing to prove. So if I have another one, my, my goal, he going to get the Willy Wonka golden ticket by getting an American passport. That's about it. My son like, that ain't right. You got to be there. I was like, yeah, I'll be there a quarter of the year. You know, I, was, I say, hey, there's a lot of kids that don't know their daddy at all. I would never do that. But yeah, so. Who knows? We'll see how it goes. I'm already getting um some love from uh, Nairobi. Couple cute joints, too. Ooh, wee. Okay, so. I said I might do it. Unboxing. The DJI Osmo Pocket 3. Yeah, that's exactly what it says. Okay, um, it's a serious unboxing now. If it's not charged, I can't turn it on. I did do a little research, watched a few videos about it and some of the new functionality. I know some people already bust out with it, but I wasn't able to bust out with mine because it didn't come before I left to go to... Uh, Thailand it didn't get here in time so I wasn't able to uh, go to Thailand and bust it out and test it out in Thailand and all of that but they got some new amazing features this is the uh, the creator combo so this one you get the, the part of the uh, extension that's also a charger so now you got this regular charge then you got an extension part that you connect to charge it while you're filming then it has a stand. It comes with a mic, the newer mic. Um, this is awesome. It does vertical and horizontal video. It's off the chain, man. Um, you know. And I shout out to my boy um uh Glenn Glenn Graham. If y'all his nine five killers, if y'all look him up, man. Incredible brother. He used to work in this uh, big, huge camera. H, what's it called? B&H. b, &H, b &H. It's a huge um, uh, camera and video and electronics store in Manhattan around 34th Street and like 8th Avenue, 7th or 8th Avenue. It's, I mean, anybody who's into photography, film, seriously, anything like that knows about B&H Photo. So he worked there, and when the Osmo Pocket, the first one came out, I think it was it came out in 2019, he told me, he said, yo, he had it at one of his little events, and he was like, yo, this is the future, and I got one, and I so I think me and Marwa was like some of the first people to have it, maybe Ace too, but I think Ace do more GoPro, but anyway, so I've been rocking with the, besides the drones, I've been rocking with the Osmo Pocket from the gate I got the first one I got the second one all those dope walking videos and all those videos and nightclubs that 3 million 500 view video and Gusto's one of the first to ever do it that was shot on the DJI pocket uh, me and my boy Tony touched the film in there <laughs> <laughs> the reason why he, we got all up in girls' face because Tony is crazy, so he just put it all in the girls' face until the security guard actually came up and told us, "Yo, you can't film like that in here." And then I got when we went to uh, La Isla, I got the footage from La Isla. That's a two-part video. First part is in Gusto, second part is in La Isla. But um, yeah. So it comes with a carry case. This is the, um, it's, it's definitely um, bigger than the uh, original one. Substantially it seems. So the, the combo comes with a carry case, which is dope. Nice, uh, like the same type of fabric that they have with the new uh, camera bags. I should have had a, a above camera, right? I ain't got time for all of that. So here it go. Here's the the actual pocket here. Oh shit! It came right on. I must have touched it. 
English. It's come in China, Chinese always, usually. And I heard if you flick it, English, yeah, we can English. Osmo Pocket, device name, download, connect, swipe to skip. Uh, five times remain. I don't know. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to skip. Well, here it is. This is the Osmo Pocket 3. What's up with my autofocus? Oh, because it's on my face. The Osmo Pocket 3. I will do all this other additional stuff. Let me just, I ain't got no memory card. This, this pack came with a memory card. Okay, so here's the camera. It's larger than it was. It shoots vertically and horizontal. You press continue and it shoots. Oh, it just turned off. Sorry, y'all. I need a little more time to play with it. This is an unboxing. Okay. So this is the extension and additional battery chart. It's like a, a additional power bank or power source. So it can also recharge your uh, recharge your pocket. Recharge it while it's on while while it's on the. Uh, while it's in use and it's also like an extension so you can recharge it and extend it all at the same time see it says it's 65 power powered up 65 so that's another part this is uh the little tripod stands because they had the last the two had a terrible little tripod connection i mean i don't even know what would prompt them to make something so terrible it was it was literally terrible it was it was janky you screwed it on it would for, i mean it, it was so terrible that i can't believe they did that so they came back with a standard size uh miniature tripod which was was smart i mean it was come on that was that was a booboo they made a booboo on that uh so it's a standard standard size a real sturdy tripod that you could really put this down uh, what else is in here this is a I guess just a, a small extension if you want it to be a little have a little more uh, I don't know it's not too small for me without the extensions so this is a little extension that you can put on it as well and this is the mic the mic automatically connects with the uh so and it has that uh where's the little battery thing the little uh, magnet thing it's supposed to come with like a little magnet so you could just put it through your clothes so here's the windscreen well anyway you could just you know boom so now when i'm walking i'm talking you can hear me really well. You should you be able to hear the person really well while they're walking and talking with the uh, with the and it has this uh, this wide angle lens that goes on top of the lens too. So yeah, I, I'll get to all of that when the time is right. I just wanted to unbox it, open it, show you guys I got it. Y'all should start seeing some. Tell me if y'all see a difference. I mean, I already use the DJI Action 3. I might get the Action 4. But um, this is the new product, DJI. DJI Osmo Pocket 3. It's 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 the bomb. It's the bomb. And uh just the carry case. And you can put the um it seems like you could put the uh, and you could connect the uh, if you want to just make moves with it you could take the mic connect the mic right here and take it on the town with you it's a little bigger than just a pocket for sure like even if you take it out the case it's not the same but it's it's it, it's still doable. But it's bigger than the other one. Step your game up. Get your name up. Osmo Pocket Three. 
comes with the mic. That's that's dope. This is is and this is the new mic that you can only get with the new Pocket Three. This is a new mic. Oh, it's an automatic focus. It's on my face. That's what. How about that? Y'all see it now? Yeah, that's what I gotta do. Switch it up. Now back to you. But yeah, so. Stay tuned. Zoe's gonna keep it moving. Uh, we about to do the little pinky show for a while. And uh, I'm probably gonna make my final decision. But I'm probably gonna uh, get on up out of Columbia. It's hot. The block is hot. The block is hot. And, um, yeah. We're going to see what it do, what it do. Y'all stay tuned. And let me know, what countries do y'all suggest I replace Colombia with? I'm, I'm, I'm in uh, Brazil. That ain't going nowhere. I'm, I'm, I'm on a property there, so I'll be there. And... Right now, I'm missing Thailand right now. I really didn't want to come back, but I had a few things I had to take care of. I really, because I have businesses and a property and stuff like that, I'm not able to do the straight three months, six months out on the road. You know, a month and a half, maybe max two months, and I have to come back here, which means I have to spend a lot more money coming back and forth then flying that money that I spent flying home, then flying somewhere else, could have been spent flying from this country to that country, really. But the other thing, I don't know how they do it. I, mean, I need a new, I need a new uh, suitcase with new fly stuff wherever I go. So, and what do they do with the old stuff? Do they just leave it and give it away? Like, what do y'all do with y'all stuff, man? I, I go with. A nice amount of, of clothes and outfits and sneakers and I need to change that up I mean it's cool to have the place in Colombia because I was able to leave some clothes there just like Thailand I was able to leave some clothes there I'm not able to leave clothes in Brazil because I'm renting out my apartment else oh, so anybody seriously now it's not finished so I don't want y'all hammering me but I know it's probably difficult for people to find a place to stay in Brazil for carnival and your boy got the two bedroom condo it needs some work but it's not terrible I stayed there I have to finish renovations after carnival they told me don't work on it during carnival it'd be very difficult to find somebody to do the work and that's the time that you can make money I already had a few offers but they didn't meet my price so yeah it's your boy it's your, it's your boss. I know it wasn't too much tech talk, but we talked. <laughs> I have some interesting topics coming up. Controversial that we're going to talk about soon. Like, subscribe, and share the video. Love is Thanks. love, life is life. Loyalty is priceless. Peace. Are you not entertained?